It is a signing day edition of the Recruiting Roundup brought to you by IBEW Local 640. I'm Jordan Hamm, and alongside Anthony Lucas, defensive end, tight end, does a little bit of everything for the Chaparral Firebirds, top player in the state, ready to make his decision. And Anthony, I'll get out of the way, let you let us know where you're headed. One place uh, I felt like was home at Uber any other, Texas A&M, go Aggies. Congratulations. What was it about Jimbo Fisher's program and Texas A&M that uh, made them the one for you? Everything about the environment that the staff and the players created over there it was just, just seemed like home to me. And um, I really felt like um, they would help me develop as a man on the field and off the field and later on in life and stuff that I would be able to use it to make sure I'll make sure I'll succeed and uh, say all the naysayers, all that, like try to prove them wrong. So I feel like it'd be cool to also like help a program and be the first to do it. You mentioned helping bring a program to new heights. You've been able to do that at Chaparral the past couple of years, help bringing them back to, you know, a new uh, a standard that they have been used to. How much did that play a role? Just being familiar with that sort of mindset that that really identified with you at Texas A and M. I mean, it would be like you're the first to do it, so your name's gonna be in the history books. You're gonna have a statue of you on the campus, being literally the best ever mm -hmm. to go walk through and change a program. And it's just something I need to do, so. At what point did you know it was Texas A&M? Maybe up until yesterday. I know how much this coaching staff has meant to you, specifically uh, Coach Zubiga, the defensive coordinator, Coach Zu, as he is uh, lovingly known. Uh, what lessons are you going to take from this coaching staff, from Coach Zu, that you think is really going to help you at the next level? Making sure, like, things like being on time. If you're on time, you're late. Make sure you're always 10, 15 minutes early. Make sure you're always putting on a good show out in public to represent yourself and the brand that you're portraying on anything that you're wearing and the school that I might be representing in the future. Or as for chaperones, wearing the chaperone, I can't be acting a fool in public, so, you know making sure you got a good head on your shoulders and making sure you understand the values of school always comes first, faith and family, and then football. And that's something that these, this coaching staff preaches and I feel, really feel like that's gonna be a big, big thing to carry me on for these next couple of years of my journey. Let's talk about on the field. What does this Aggie coaching staff envision you doing on the field? What center, type of role are you going to be filling on that defense? Uh, strong side end, you know. Going to set the edge, protect the edge, rush the passer, stop the run from the edge, you know, all the good stuff. Mm -hmm. Maybe occasionally drop, guard a tight end, running back on the flat, wheel route, all that stuff. And then maybe a little bit of goal, some goal line for sure. And then probably some, I'm going to try to sneak in some open field. Mm -hmm. be, be a well-rounded prospect there. Yeah. yeah. You're already thinking ahead. I, yeah. I like it. Um, this Chaparral community, what, what have they done to help you get to where you are today? There's always shown support. Never really had um, any problems as uh, for me just being like, like ever trying to be messed with out. Kind of partially because I think like my size, but it's like still it's just like, you know, everybody seems to have a little bit of respect, even if it's like fake, but like, you know, I still try to make sure I'm as nice as possible to everybody just in case, you know, you never know what they're going through and all that. And um, there's no reason to just like not pay attention. Like, you know, I'm not just gonna go and ignore it. So, I mean, I just try to do everything I can and um, I feel really encouraged and a lot of support and um, feel love. And my last question for you, for the Texas A&M fans that haven't seen what you're all about on the field, what you're all about off the field, what can they expect from you the next couple of years? I mean, any, everything that you ever needed. Like, I'm the full package. I do everything. Like, don't worry about it. Yeah.
right? Anthony Lucas, Chaparral Firebird, top player in the state of Arizona, now your newest Texas A&M Aggie.